How are we doing folks? So we're out again. Right, I'm going to do a wee quick review at the start of this video. So big thanks uh, to One Wind. One Wind have sent me a nice wee tarp. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this up. Uh, I'm going to put the hammock up tonight. I'm going to do a wee bit of cooking after this as well, but the start of the video is uh, the one wind tarp. So, let's see what we got. So, obviously it comes in a nice wee stuff sack. I like this. Right, it comes with all the, the four wee carabiners are attached and I'll show you what these are for as I go through the video. So as well as that you got a set of pegs. Right, so you got one, two, four pegs and Six guy lines. Right, I've got something in here as well. So right, so, let's like see, the four pegs and the six guy lines. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to set these up first before I actually put the tarp out. But it does look quite a good wee tarp. Uh, we'll see how it holds up in the weather tonight. I don't know whether it's to rain tonight or not, it's both skies just now, but I'll wait and see. Anyway, let's get the guy ropes on. Right, each of the, the tie-out points, quite like this. It's got these wee kind of nozzles, so... Basically just tuck that up, that's that right. Tuck it up through there. Don't know how well you can see this. And then back through the other wee hole. And then boom. Right. So we obviously got to do that for, for all six. Right, so once you've done that, another wee handy thing with this, which I quite like, is you can tuck on with a spare guy line inside here. I don't know how well you can see that. And then you pull that other section down. It basically holds all your spare guy line. Obviously depending how far you need to bring it out. Quite like that, that's a good wee, good wee design. Right, once you've got the, the guy lines on, obviously then you're just stringing the, the tarp up, up between two trees. You've got the wee uh, kind of logo on the outside as well. It looks a good wee tarp. As well as that, you'll notice these two tie-out points. There's two on each side, yeah, so I'll show you what they are for as well. Right, so there's, obvious, there's obviously different configurations you can put this up in, but handy hang the wee carabiners as the two end sections. You can clip them on at both sides. So, another good wee design. As well as that, you've also got these additional tie-out points, so you could add even more guy, guy lines to them as well, just to bring it out a wee bit. So that's what it looks like, uh, with the, the tie out points either side kind of tied back. Obviously I've, I've not set up the other side yet, uh, but you can do that on both sides. Uh, next up I think is the, if you want to enclose it, 
so obviously if it's a windy night then this is the next configuration you want to do I really like that right, so as you can see that's it, closed up obviously you can do this at both ends but you basically just again get the carabiners and they basically you just pull them either side and that brick makes it all nice and taut and basically the whole thing's enclosed right so obviously this is up to the inside but you can see that's totally enclosed the whole top obviously if you do it at both sides in fact we'll just come in and I'll, I'll do the other side as well well that's one side enclosed that's the other side enclosed so basically you've got no wind coming in at all I really do like that, that's a good design so please do that set up so that's the wind wind tarp what I've done is I've, uh, I've also set up I've, got, I've just got my DD hammock tonight and my one Tigris under blanket so obviously I don't need the uh, the, uh, what do you call it, the uh, hammock with the bug necks in the middle of winter so there's no midges it's always a bonus but that's the uh, so what I'll do I'll, uh, I'll probably use my arctic winter bag tonight and that's quite cold last night so and I've, I'm not too far away so I'm not having to hike it far but it looks a pretty good bit of kit I must admit I do like it obviously you could attach the, the extra guy points out that section as well but I'll do that another time I don't think I need that tonight it's not if it's even that windy but it's looking pretty good though I think we'll get a few nights out in this I do like the look of it, especially the fact the ends uh, cross over. So on a windy night it's going to be superb. What I'll do is I'll, uh, I'll put a lot of the weights etc down below. Uh, no, I can't remember what hydrostatic head that is off the top of my head, but I'll, I'll find that out and I'll put that once I edit this video. Hopefully that gives you a, a good idea of the, the one wind tarp. But I really do like the look of it, it looks, looks pretty good. I'll test it out tonight like I say and see how it holds up. Don't know whether it's the rain tonight or not. But definitely do like the look of it. I think the uh, I think we'll get a good get a good sleep under it. I think it'll keep us dry. But it's definitely, I like all the different wee kind of wee designs to it, wee uh, carabiners, the fact it closes on either end, extra tie out points, it's got the, the tighteners for the guy lines, it's got a lot of good stuff on it that some tarps you get don't have it. I've obviously got other tarps uh, which are good as well but this one I reckon, I reckon I will actually use this quite a bit. Well, I'll be using it tonight. So, we'll see how it holds up. I was going to do a bit of cooking in this video, but I'll maybe just, uh, I'll keep that for another video. Or maybe you just I'll do a camp video separate to this. But, looks good, doesn't it? Well, I think it does. We'll see how it holds up. So, tonight, I'm going to do this uh, kind of during the week, I would, uh, during the week, Saturday would have been my, another one of my live shows. That's it, uh, another wee video bye, so just a wee review video of this tarp, so if you like the wee video, get a thumbs up, give it a, uh, sorry, give it a thumbs up, a like, uh, subscribe if you haven't, hit the bell for notifications, we'll see you in the next one, adios.